Good afternoon, Poké Sports, and welcome to another VGC Battle Stadium video. Back on the Battle Stadium with another rental code, also from Dakota slash store brand, store brand Blossom in the Discord. He did have just another team appear yesterday, but that just goes to show you guys, you can you can submit as much as you want. I don't care about repeats. If you guys got an interesting team, I'm probably gonna click on it. And if you guys want me to play the team on the channel, go into the description, click that Discord button. And, uh, and uh, go into the Discord, go into the rental codes chat, and post your rental code. Here we have a fun team. I haven't played a fun team in a long time, but you know what? It's the end of the season. The season. All of our ratings are going to reset. It doesn't matter. Let's have some fun. So here we have a Hales Room Team hybrid thing. I know. There's a Flygon. There's a Rotom Blizzard. Rotom Refrage. Rotom F. I think that's what it's called. Rotom Frost. We got an Obama Snow. We, we're we all over the place here, so I'm really excited to see what this does. Um, but you know what? Let's go. Right off the bat, I see the Trick Room, and I see the Trick Room Pokemon, and I'm a little bit afraid of them. It does have three Trick Room Pokemon-esque uh, things in it, but thankfully we do actually function pretty quite pretty well in Trick Room. I definitely do want to bring the Conkelder in the back for that, um, for that Snorlax. And I can totally bring the Obama, uh, the Obama Snow in the back too, just to combat that uh that drought if I have to. It's actually a very interesting scenario I'm putting myself in. So I think actually leading Flygon and then leading Duraludon would be really nice here, and then have Conkeldor, Obama Snow in the back. So we're we're gonna we're gonna leave the Rotom Frost behind. I could bring it for Blizzard spams, but I think I'm gonna go. I'm gonna do without it for now. I'm gonna do without it, but if you guys are excited for Flygon and Obama Snow, remember to hit the like button down below and subscribe to the channel because we are so darn close to a thousand subscribers. Show our support to Poke Sports because we're just trying to grow, guys, and you guys are doing amazing so far. I'm also interested on that safety goggles. I, that probably could have done well here, just for people trying to sleep the Trick Room Setter. I'm assuming Jellison is the Trick Room Setter here. Also, if you want to rent a code to this team at the end of the video. What are your leads, lady? Diggersby and Dusclops. Do we just go ham here? I almost want to just go ham here. I don't know if I care about Dusclops. Actually, I think I want Dusclops dead. So let's go for the Specs Draco. Oh wait, we have Dragon Tail. Oh, but I think... Yeah, I think we have to... We still have to double in. So let's go for the Specs Draco. Let's go for the Dynamax. Max Wormwind into you. We're doubling down here. I really hope that um, we're we're actually Dynamaxing first, so we might be outspeeding that. What's that thing called, Diggersby? I hope that would be really nice. If you outspeed that Diggersby, that means we're not going down to an earthquake. Oh no, he just didn't Dynamax. You have Protect on your thing. Dude, that blows my mind. Yes, okay, we're gonna get the negative one on the Wormwind, though. You have Protect on your Dusclops. Why do I feel like that doesn't exist? I can't be the only one, right? He did just burn a turn of my Dynamax, which does kind of make me a little bit sad. That goes for AQ. Well, you're at negative one and we have a Levitator, so that's, that's kind of okay. Ooh, we don't appreciate that still. Um, okay, let's double check his Pokemon. He, has, he does have a fairy type. So I'm gonna relocate my attack onto the Diggersby with my Flygon since I can't change that one. And we're gonna go for the Steel Spike. Onto the Dusclops. That'll raise our defenses at least. I think it could work out well. 
I do feel like the, the Togekiss is coming in here on that Dusclops spot. And if it doesn't, we might be in a little bit of a problem. But I guess we'll cross that road when we get there. Ideally, Dusclops switches out. I don't think it does. No, it doesn't. Oof. Draco's gonna connect. No Dynamax yet for my opponent. This is gonna be big damage. Ooh, almost an Oko. Oh, that's so close, Flygon. If only I had one more base attack. If only. I think Dusclops gets trick room up here. Yep. I should have doubled in Dusclops. That's me over predicting. Unless he goes for EQ and KOs his own Dusclops, that'd be great. Do it. KO. Yes! He actually did it by critting his Dusclops. Oh, it's so great. <laughs> we live because of the defense boost. Bruh. Okay, so this thing is 100% Joyce banded onto EQ, so I kind of don't even want to... I guess I can just hit it with the Draco, since I'm negative 2 anyway. Hi, Venusaur. Nice to see you. Um, do I switch? No, I guess I have a bomb snow for Venusaur. Maybe I should switch. Yo, go into Kinkelder. And then we'll max light. Oh, we can't. Uh, we'll max lightning anyway, just so we can set up the terrain. So that Venusaur can't sleep us. We'll just leave this Diggersby on the field for one more turn. I'm pretty sure Venusaur's protecting this turn anyway, because it's going for EQ. Oh, switches out Diggersby, even better. I'll deal, I'll, I'll deal with that 1 HP Diggersby later. Sends out Drought. Ooh, so he's going to be outspeeding. And Dynamaxing. Okay. What did he go for here? Probably Earth Power onto the, my um, Duralodon, if I had to guess. That would be my lucky guess. I also wanted to preserve the Flygon for this Torkoal specifically, so it's good that I switched out there. It does go for the Max Quake. He will be able to take us out. That's okay. He's going to lose his speed. Granted, not that his speed matters too much. Oh, I know what I'll do. I'm gonna have to play a, a couple of Switch games. No pun intended. We will... Bring our Flygon in here. We will hard swap out into a Bomba Snow to get rid of the sun, make it so that we outspeed Venusaur. Do we want to lock ourselves? Do we want to flamethrower in the sun? This is Specs flamethrower in the sun. How much damage do we think it'll do? Ooh. Only one way to find out, boys. Only one way to find out. Dakota, I trust you. I'm going to trust that there's a reason this isn't Fire Blast. I'm playing the Weather Wars, boys. Hello, this is an Obama Snow. A Pokemon that should not be on the field right now because you have a Fire move and a Poison move. We do have Sash, though, real talk. Torkoal protects. Thank God I didn't attack that Torkoal with an EQ or I made an Earth Power. Oh, I also just realized I'm out of the sun because I took out my sun. That wouldn't have done enough anyway. That is a. L that, are you a. S no, you're Life Orb. What? That just Oko's me. I understand why Flygun isn't very used now. We're in a little bit of trouble. Not gonna lie. What can we do? Um, Kelder, I need you to crit Drain Punch. Even though I don't think it's gonna matter, sadly. I need to just 
Blizzard and Drain Punch. This might be this might be going downhill from here, boys. <laughs> it could also rock slide, but I think Drain Punch is still my better option. It's okay, Venusaur's Dynamax ends next turn. I think he has to switch out the Torkoal here, right? And then I just get the free KO on the the Diggersby. But honestly, that just means that this Venusaur will 100% take this, um... Yeah, he does. Okay, he does switch just so the Venusaur can have the speed later. I'm gonna take- I'm gonna take out the Diggersby for free. But... This Blizzard is going to do... Not- nothing! Why is this Venusaur so tanky? <laughs> I guess just that special defense from the- the Max... Yeah. That special defense from the Max Quake is making such a big difference, and this is gonna 100% KO me. Oh no, it doesn't. Alright, cool. How do we tolerate this? We just have to drain punch now, right? That that uh this max overgrowth is helping out this Venusaur so much. Okay, real talk. I'm pretty sure I can KO this Venusaur next turn. But I have no idea how I'm going to KO this Torkoal. Um, but I think Blizzard here. Followed by Drain Punch. A Mach Punch here. Just so I get some damage off on this Torkoal this turn. Venusaur protects. Smart man, smart man. He's going for the heat wave here. I actually could have protect. Mm. Just goes for the eruption instead. We live at one, boys. I could have actually outplayed this a little better. Granted that um, I just didn't expect one Venusaur being so tanky after just one Max Quake, but Venusaur is already a tanky Pokemon. Real talk, my opponent just played it better than me, but don't worry, we will take out a Venusaur here. Look at this. Ice Shard. Boom. Maybe. <laughs> oh, yes. Brought it down to a 1-0. Time to miss your eruption somehow. Went for the Earth Power instead. I guess why not, right? Actually, I was at 11 HP. Maybe there was a chance. <laughs> We'll get him next time, boys. Okay, my opponent is bringing a real team. Very scary team. But a team that is actually pretty weak to... I could try to Blizzard Spam here. It does have some weaknesses. I also do like Kinkelder here. Kinkelder is strong against three Pokemon on his team. I just have to find a way of dealing with that uh, pre-Marina. But I have a couple of ways. Let's see. Do I set up Ch uh, Trick Room here? I think I do. Trick Room in Prison. Water Spout Shadow Ball. Water Spout is pretty nice here. Yeah, let's set up Trick Room. And then what else? If they decide to bring the Incineroar, it's a little bit of a problem. Do I do Rotom? Do I Volt Switch? Probably. I'm Choice Scarfed. Yeah. Oh, I'm also Trick. Okay, cool. I can do Rotom, Jellicent, Obama Snow, Conkelder. I never thought I'd have to say those four Pokemon in a row like that. <laughs> we'll see how it goes. Um, if I see the opportunity not to set up Trick Room, I won't. It all depends on what my my opponent wants. Detar Excadrill. Drill. Boring. Okay, cool. We can have some fun here though. Double rock slide is like incredibly obvious. 
right? So... Do we Dynamax or Jellicent? I don't think our Jellicent has like any investment at all. I almost want to go for the Spout. And then Volt Switch out. Yeah, let's Volt Switch out. And then go for the Water Spout. Bring in our Kinkeldy, that should take a thousand Rock Slides. It's gonna go for the Dynamax, probably on the Tyranitar, if I had to guess. This is gonna be a rough battle, but we're gonna try our best. Hi, Tita, you're very large. You are a large thing. We need to switch out. EQ is gonna outspeed. Break his own uh, weakness policy, actually. Do a lot of damage to Jellicent. Actually, a lot of damage onto T-Tart, too. T-Tart don't like that too much. Oh, and we disabled the EQ. That's nice. Let's full switch out of here. Do a little bit more chip damage. Um, do we do Kinkelder or do we just bring in a Bomb of Snow? Let's bring a Bomb of Snow. Simply because we could change the weather and go for Leaf Storm after. Then at least we get rid of this uh, special defense. So we get some nice chip damage off the T-Tar. Max Darkness. I'm actually happy he went for that. Yeah, get rid of Jellicent. I'm not using it. And now I can get a free switch on, switch in onto Kinkelder here. And my Focus Sash is still intact on my Abomas Snow too. So, I'm pretty happy with this. Can I Ice Shard that Excadrill? And expect it to KO? I'm pretty sure I can Mach Punch that Tyranitar that health. Yeah, I'm pretty sure. Mach Punch should be enough of that health. Followed by... I don't, I'm not so sure about the Ice Shard though. Actually, I still have a D-Max attack. What am I D-Maxing? Should I D-Max a Bomb of Snow? No, that's weird. I kind of don't want to D-Max yet. I'll hold it. I'll hold it a little bit longer. Does Ice Shard take care of Excadrill? I doubt it. How much? 40 damage? Eh. I'll just Blizzard. Withdraws anyway. Okay, that's fine. Uh, I'm okay with that. I'm happy with that. Maybe predicted the Mach Punch on the Excadrill. But nah. Mach Punch on T-Tar. Goodbye. Cool. Dynamax, weakness policy, big boy gone. We still have our Dynamax intact. This is actually still a very close game. And if you decide to trick room here, then you're just helping my Conkelder out. This is a single targeted Blizzard. Freeze it! Nah, no freeze. It's fine. I'm going to chip away at it, though. What is it, Togekiss? Free Mariner. Oh, boy. I think now it's the time to Dynamax. I am not afraid of a Trick Room here. Double switch? Oh, smart man. He's still gonna go down, though. That was a little bit- he did bait me. So he will get the trick room off, but it doesn't matter. Because at the end of the day... The Exodrill goes down to the Blizzard. And I could still hit Primarina next turn if you trick room. Because your Dynamax is gone. Bomb of Snow putting in work here, boys. Some serious work. Freeze? No, not today. And then Max Lightning onto. Actually, I'm just. Yeah, I'm just gonna take it out. Oh, no, I'm not. Never mind. You're very tanky. Probably Max Defense, if I had to guess.
Does go for the trick room. I'm pretty sure my Conkelder is slower than your Primarina, Tom Tom. I'm just saying. I'm just saying. I'm pretty sure. But I guess there's only one way to find out, right? Max Lightning, boom. Blizzard, boom. Ooh, annoying, but not the end of the world. Cause we're out speeding. Yeah. Okay. Cool. <laughs> bye. 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 <laughs> that works. Now it's Dust Clops versus my whole team, boy. You could try, but eventually we're gonna out damage you. That's a very. We won with the team. That's all that matters. Maybe. It's not over till it's over. Okay, well, let's let's make it over. Let's just go for Blizzard. There's no reason to go for any other move in the game. <laughs> Battle is canceled. GG. Dakota, you always got these very spicy teams. If you guys are familiar with Dakota, he's the one that requested Avalug. He's the one that requested Frostlass. So he's, he always requests the ice types. And clearly he loves ice types. He had a Mammoth on the last team and an Obama Snow in this team. But yeah, here's the rental code if you guys want. I hope you guys did enjoy this. If you did, you know what to do. Like and comment down below along with subscribe to the channel on our road to a thousand subscribers. Very, very close and we couldn't do it without you guys. You guys are the best. I'm Kevin. This is Pogi Sports. Have a great night. Join our Discord so that you can leave me a rental code. Peace out.